President Erdogan, we can keep relations with Syria alive. After the Friday prayers, President Erdogan said that relations with Syria could be kept alive again. As we have kept our relations with Syria alive, you know we had these meetings with Mr. Assad, we can meet again tomorrow, Erdogan said. President Recep Tayyip Erdogan performed the Friday prayer at HZ, Ali Mosque. President Erdogan answered the questions of journalists after the prayer. Making statements on many issues ranging from the demolished building in Bakalivler to the relations with Syria, Erdogan stated that there is no obstacle to the development of relations with Syria. We can meet with Assad again, making a statement on how relations with Syria will progress. Erdogan used the following expressions. We will act together to improve relations with Syria in the same way as we have acted together in the past. The Syrian people are a community where we live as brotherly people. As we have kept our relations with Syria alive, as you know, we had these meetings with Mr. Assad and we can meet again tomorrow. We have no intention to interfere in Syria's internal affairs. Let's secure urban transformation across the country. Erdogan responded to a question about the demolished building in Bakalivler as follows. We need to go for urban transformation in places where ground surveys of such illegal structures cannot be done correctly. The problem with the buildings that are being demolished right now is that three floors are illegal, and demolition was in question here because of the illegality. I am a president who came from the mayor's office. I know this kind of work well. Just as we have successfully carried out urban transformations so far, we want to secure the work throughout the country. We will not allow any abuse with Mr. Devlet. Speaking about the future of the People's Alliance, President Erdogan said the following. As you know, we have been working with Mr. Devlet as an important representative of the People's Alliance for a long time. We have continued our talks without interruption, and we will continue them from now on. We will not allow any abuse. We are discussing with Mr. Devlet what is happening in the political development of our country and what measures we need to take. We are taking steps both as MHP and AK Party.